It's really big, seriously. Oh, there I am. Hi! This is the best bit. I love this. It's like a do it yourself chaise lounge. It's pretty cool. Actually, I might get some room service tonight because I'm really, really tired. Today's been mental. So, uh, we need to count the money from Middlesbrough, which was cut short, you'll read about that in the blog. So um, I'm gonna count this and then I'll get back to you. Oh, in fact, let's pour it out and see what it looks like. Oh, this is that stupid bag again, look. <laughs> oh, it's pound hiding there, look. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's it. There's nothing else left. Okay, right. I'll count this, then I'll come back and let you know how much we made in Middlesbrough. So we got cut short today. I only did 30 minutes in Middlesbrough. Um, we've made 74 pounds and 55 pence, and that took 30 minutes. That's pretty good going. Much better than I thought it'd be. Thank you, Middlesbrough. Thank you, Middlesbrough. So we busked for longer in Newcastle. So let's see what the money looks like from Newcastle. Right, I'll count this and then I'll bet back to you and let you know how much. Bye. Then we've counted up the totals for Newcastle, which is sixty-six pounds and sixty-three pence, which makes today's total one hundred and forty-one pounds eighteen, which is a massive drop from yesterday's. Um, if, bear in mind, I only did 30 minutes in Middlesbrough and that came to £74.55, if we'd have actually done, is it two, two hours we were meant to do, if we'd have done the full two hours there, can you imagine what the figure would have been? Um, if you read my blog later on, you'll see why we only stayed there for half an hour, um, which is really disappointing. But we've got tomorrow in Carlisle, so we'll see how that goes. Bye! So we've just worked out that if we'd have done the full two hours in Middlesbrough, we would have made an extra £280. Which means that because of Middlesbrough Town Centre Management, Hilton in the Community Foundation and Cancer Research UK have missed out on an extra £280, which I'm not best pleased about. Um, you'll read about why in the blog, or shall I just tell him? Well, they could have used the discretion and allowed us to finish, which would have enabled us to like make that much money for the charities. Um, the whole reason, the busking licence there is free, and the collection. collection permit is free, but you have to apply 28 days before for permission to actually perform there. Check. They wanted a CRB check, in those, 28 days. in those 28 days because that apparently allows you to collect money but my dad who's a magistrate showed them his magistrate's badge and, and said you know I'm a magistrate and what was the response? You still need to ring, uh, write in 28 days. Still need to write in 28 days before so we showed them the tweets from Hilton in the Community Foundation saying you know good luck and everything and the promotional stuff that we had printed and uh, they weren't having any of it were they? No. So I was really disappointed and um, while I was there um, one of my biggest fans Chris Cook's mum and dad turned up to see me um, they only got there in time to hear two songs didn't they? And then I had to leave and everyone was like boo which was quite good yeah so yeah anyway I'm gonna go and sleep um, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye! I'm bringing Newcastle Town Centre Management because Middles removed us on. Because apparently you've made a license to see you to apply 28 days before. Chris Cook's just tweeted me. That's a shame, just spoke to my 
my mum and she told me all about it. Oh, I'm number two in the queue. Ooh. Thank you for holding. You were caught as a position two. Thank 